New property assessments are in the mail for Nassau County's one and a half million residents, and that means taxes could be going up or down. But confused residents who were just reassessed last year are asking, why again? CBS 2's Carolyn Gussoff explains. Scott Diamond answers a flood of questions on a Nassau taxpayer group page he manages. There's a lot of confusion. Confusion because just last year there was a countywide reassessment to fix property values that had been frozen and broken for years. So why are new assessments in the mail again? My assessment went up uh, just under 5%. Because Nassau is now reassessing property every year. County Executive Laura Curran says they are as close to accurate as possible, but tweaked annually by now qualified assessors. Each year we're looking at the trends and we're making sure that the assessment is in line with what's happening in the real world with fair market value. Necessary to keep property values current, but critics don't like the timing. Let's say you've challenged your assessment and your challenge is currently pending before for the county. Uh, the county has now come out with a new assessment before your challenge was ever heard. It's very confusing to the homeowners and the county has done a very poor job of explaining it. Add to the confusion, bills also arriving from private tax grievance companies for money saved from 2018, even though taxes may have stayed the same. Many people did not realize the savings, okay? Um, that's very clear. But they would have paid more had they not hired someone to do it in the first place. A system so broken it all but guaranteed anyone who filed a grievance would win, creating a half billion dollar grievance firm industry. Tax expert Jeff Gold says finally, residents won't have to grieve. Well, the system before was the worst system in the state and right now we're gonna, if not this year, by next year will be the best. The rolls are really that accurate. You can still grieve this year's assessments till April 1st, but reductions will no longer be rubber stamped. The county will defend itself, arguing that once wildly inaccurate home values are now correct. In Levittown, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News. And the Nassau County Executive would like the new tax assessments phased in over five years. The issue will be debated at the Nassau Legislature on the evening of March 4th.